The World Chess Championship 2014 was a match between the world champion Magnus Carlsen and challenger Viswanathan Anand, to determine the world chess champion. It was held from 7 to 28 November 2014, under the auspices of the World Chess Federation in Sochi, Russia. The match was decided after 11 of 12 scheduled games. On 23 November 2014 Carlsen retained his title, winning three games, losing one and drawing seven. <laughs> <laughs> Candidates tournament The challenger was determined in the 2014 Candidates Tournament, an eight-player double round-robin tournament that took place in Kanti Mansaisk, Russia, from 13 March to 31 March 2014. The participants, in order of rules announced by FIDE, were The tournament had a prize fund of €420,000. Prize money was shared between players tied on points, tiebreaks were not used to allocate it. The prizes for each place were as follows. Results In the event of a tie, the following tiebreak methods were used, in order of precedence Head-to-head -head scores between the tied players Highest number of wins The player with the highest Sonneborn Berger score Rapid chess playoffs Championship match The championship match between Magnus Carlsen and Viswanathan Anand was held from 7 to 28 November 2014 in Sochi, Russia, under the auspices of FIDE. <laughs> Previous head-to-head -head record Prior to the match, from 2005 to 6 November 2014, Anand and Carlsen had played 40 games against each other at classical time controls, out of which Carlsen won 6, Anand won 6, and 28 were drawn. Historical notes Both Carlsen and Anand appeared in the 2013 championship, Anand as the reigning world champion and Carlsen as the challenger. This marked the first time the same two opponents met in consecutive world championship matches since Garry Kasparov played Anatoly Karpov five times between 1984 and 1990. Anand is only the second former champion after Karpov in 1987 and 1990 to win a candidates tournament. At 44, Anand is the second oldest person to win a candidates tournament, behind Viktor Korchnoi in 1977 and 1981. <laughs> World Championship Organization The match organizers faced several significant hurdles in organizing the event. The match venue was not finalized until June 2014, because the formal application from Norway, which was expected to host the title match at the time, was not forthcoming. FIDE President Kursen Alyumjinov announced in June that the match would be held in Sochi, Russia, in November 2014, disclosing an agreement to host the match signed with the regional governor of Russia's Krasnodar region, Alexander Tetyov. In the third week of August, Carlsen requested that the match be postponed because he was not satisfied with the choice of venue. However, Anand agreed to play versus Carlsen in Sochi on the proposed dates, and in early August, Carlsen signed the agreement to defend his title in Sochi. This left the organizers, Agone Limited, the holder of rights to holding FIDE international tournaments only two months to prepare and organize the event. However, Agone successfully met its obligations, organizing the event to everyone's satisfaction. 
Nevertheless, the minimum prize fund of €2 million Euros specified in the FIDE Agone contract was not met, failing by 50%. Gazprom and Summer Group were the main sponsors of the match. According to the World Championships website, the 2014 title match broke global audience records, drawing more than 1 million viewers every day. The total number of unique visitors to the website during the match was 10.5 million, with 2 million people visiting the match website on the final day. Venue <inaudible> 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 The match was held at the Olympic Media Center located in the Adler City district of Sochi, Imeretinsky Valley, on the Black Sea, next to the Sochi Olympic Park houses and the main Fisht Olympic Stadium. The Olympic Media Center served as the main media hub during the 2014 Winter Olympics. Andre Filipovich was chief arbiter for the match. The FIDE press officer and photographer was Ukrainian woman Grand Master Anastasia Karlovich, who previously officiated at the World Chess Championships in 2012 and 2013. Topic: Seconds. Both Carlsen and Anand had a team of seconds to aid in their match preparation. During the opening press conference, Anand revealed his seconds to be Krishnan Sasakiran, Radoslaw Wojtashik and Gregorz Gajewski. Carlsen's seconds were Peter Heiner Nielsen and John Ludwig Hammer, although after the closing ceremony, in an interview with Chief Fide Press Officer Anastasia Karlovich Carlsen revealed that also Laurent Fresenet and Michael Adams were helping him from home. Carlsen was also in touch with Garry Kasparov before the match. During the match Garry Kasparov was regularly in contact with Peter Heiner Nielsen to give advice. During the match, the Carlsen seconds team Hammer, Fresenet and Adams was located in the Norwegian resort of Kragero helping him remotely, while Nielsen Carlsen's main coach was present in Sochi. <laughs> Format The championship match consisted of 12 games and, if necessary, tie-break games. The winner of the match would be the first player to score 6.5 points or more. The time control for the classical portion of the match was 120 minutes for the first 40 moves, 60 minutes for the next 20 moves, and then 15 minutes for the rest of the game with an increment of 30 seconds per move starting after move 61. Had tiebreakers been necessary, four rapid games would have been played at a time control of 25 minutes plus a 10 second increment per move. If the score was still equal, up to five two-game blitz matches five minutes plus three seconds would have been played, before a final Armageddon game. In that game, White would have received five minutes, Black four minutes and a three-second increment after move 61 for both. In the event of a draw, the player of the Black pieces would have been declared champion. The games were played according to the FIDE laws of chess prior to 1 July 2014, in order to keep uniformity throughout the entire championship cycle. Prize fund The prize fund was €1 million. Euros. This is the minimum prize fund stipulated by FIDE in the official regulations. However, the FIDE Agone contract had required a €2 million Euro minimum. If the match ended within the 12 regular games, 60% of the prize fund would go to the winner, while the loser receives the remaining 40%. If the match went to tie-break games, the winner would receive 55% and the loser 45%. <laughs> Schedule The opening ceremony was held on 7 November 2014. The drawing of colors was held also at the opening ceremony. 
Unlike the 2013 match, Anand played with the white pieces in the first game. The game started daily at 1500 Moscow time, UTC plus 3 o'clock. Topic: Results. Topic: Games. The player named first played the white pieces. Topic: Game one: Anand Carlson, one half to one half. The first game of the match was played on 8 November 2014. The game saw Anand use the Queen's pawn opening, to which Carlsen replied with the Grunfeld defense. Anand, who went down on time as the game progressed, fought a Queen and Rook middle game to eventually draw with the world champion. Carlsen didn't make the best of his chances with 42. Re 3. He allowed a quick draw after 42. Re 2 RB 4 B 5 44. QH 1. Grunfeld defense, exchange variation. Eco D 85 1. D 4 N F 6 2. C 4 G 6 3. N C 3 D 5 4. C X D 5 N X D 5 5. BD2 BG76 E4 NXC37 BXC3 8 QD2 NC69 NF3 BG410 D5 BXF311 BXG7 KXG712 GXF3 NE513 OOC614 QC3 F615 BH3 CXD516 EXD5 NF717 F4 QD618 QD4 RAD819 B6 QB620 QD2 ROAD621 RHE1 ND822 F5 NXE623 RXE6 QC7 plus 24 KB1 RC825 RDE1 RXE626 RXE6 Road 827 QE3728 D6 EXD629 QD4 RF730 FXG6 HXG631 RXD6 A632 A3 QA533 F4 QH534 QD2 QC535 Road 5 QC436 Road 7 QC637 Road 6 QE4 plus 38 Car 2 RE739 QC1 A540 QF1 A441 Road 1 QC242 Road 4 diagram re 243 RB4 B544 QH1 re 745 QD5 re 146 QD7 plus KH647 QH3 plus kilogram 748 QD7 plus 1 half to 1 half topic Game 2, Carlson Anand, 1–0 The second game was played on 9 November 2014. The opening was the solid Berlin variation of the Rai Lopez where Carlson played 4, D3 instead of the main line 4.0–0 NXE4. Carlsen gave up the bishop pair to double Anand's C pawns and the result of the opening was roughly equal. However, Anand's moves 16 Road 8, 18 B6, and 19 Ing 6 all contributed to making his position more unpleasant. In the heavy piece endgame Carlsen's active pieces and outpost on E6 gave him a clear advantage. 
The game ended abruptly when Anand blundered with 34 h5, allowing 35, qb7 forcing instant resignation, because there is no good defense to 36, rxg7 plus kh8 37, rh7 plus kilogram 838, qg7 with checkmate. 34 qd2 was the way to fight on but Anand's chances of a successful defense were slim. Carlsen took the lead in the match. Rai Lopez, Berlin Defense Eco C65 1. E4 E5 2. NF3 NC63. B flat 5 NF64. D3 BC55. 0 to 0 D66. Re1 0 0 7. BXC6 BXC68. H3 Re89. NBD second 710. NC4 B flat 611. A4 A5 12. NXB6 CXB6 13. D4 Q C7 14. Ra3 NF8 15. DX E5 DX E5 16. NH4 Road 8 17. QH5 F6 18. NF5 B6 19. RG3 ing 6 20. H4 BXF5 21. EXF5 NF4 22. BXF4 EXF4 23. RC3 C5 24. RE6 RAB 8 25. RC4 QD7 26. KH2 RF8 27. RCE4 RB7 28. QE2 B5 29. B3 BX A4 30. BX A4 RB4 31. RE7 QD6 32. QF3 RX E4 33. QX E4 F3 plus 34. G3 diagram H5 35. QB7 1 0. Topic. Game 3, Anand Carlsen, 1–0 The third game was played on of November 2014. Anand's superior opening preparation was the decisive factor in this game. In a sharp, topical variation of the Queen's Gambit declined involving an early Queen's side attack by White, he improved on an earlier game between Levon Aronian and Michael Adams. He soon had a clear advantage, his C pawn on the seventh rank being far more dangerous than Carlsen's past a pawn. Carlsen, down to six minutes, blundered with 28. Bar 5, although his position was very bad anyway. Anand leveled the match at 1.5 to 1.5. Over two matches, the earlier 2013 match and this match, this is Anand's only victory over Carlsen in a World Championship game. Queen's Gambit declined. Eco D37-1. D4 Nf6-2. C4 E6-3. Nf3 D5-4. Nc3 B7-5. Bf4 O6. E3 Nb D7-7. C5 C6 8. BD3 B6 9. B4 A5 10. A3 bar 6 11. BX A6 RX A6 12. B5 CX B5 13. C6 Q C8 14. C7 B4 15. NB5 A4 16. RC1 NE4 17. ING5 NDF6 18. NXE4 NXE4 19. F3 RA 520. FXE4 RXB 521. QXA4 RA 522. QC6 BXA 323. EXD5 RXD 524. QXB6 QD725. 0 to 0 RC826. RC6 G527. BG3 B flat 428. Ra 1 diagram bar 529. 
QA6 BXC730, QC4E531, BXE5 RXE532, DXE5 QE733, E6KF834, RC110. Topic Game Four: Carlson Anand, one half to one half. The fourth game was played on the 12th of November 2014. Anand played the first Sicilian of the match. Carlson opting to avoid the open Sicilian with the quiet three G3. Carlson eventually gained a small advantage due to Black's isolated deep horn, but Anand defended robustly. The game ended in a hard-fought draw. Sicilian defense, Eco B40, King's Indian attack, Eco A07-1. E4 C52. NF3 E63. G3 NC64. BG2 D55. EXD5 EXD56. 0 to 0 NF67. D4 B78. B3 CXD49, NXD4 BG410, QD3 QD711, ND2 012, N2 F3 RFE813, RFE1 BD614, C3 H615, QF1 BH516, H3 BG617, RAD1 RAD818 NXC6 BXC619 C4 B420 BD4 NH721 CXD5 BXD522 RXE8 plus RXE823 QD3 NF824 NH4 B525 BXD5 QXD526 BXE5 QXE527 B3 Ne628. NF3 QF629. Kilogram 2 Road 830. QE2 Road 531. RXD5 CXD532. Ne5 QF533. ND3 ND434. G4 diagram QD735. QE5 Ne636. Kilogram 3 QB 537. NF4 NXF 438. KXF 4 QB 4 plus 39. KF3 D 440. QE 8 plus KH 741. QXF 7 QD 242. QF 5 plus KH 843. H4 QX A 244. QE 6 QD 245. QE8 plus KH746. QE4 plus KH847. QE8 plus KH7 and a half to one half. Topic Game 5. Anand Carlson, one half to one half. The fifth game was played on the 14th of November 2014. Carlson played a rare line in the Queen's Indian defence, but Anand was well prepared and soon gained the advantage. On move 22, Carlson made a risky decision to capture a pawn on b2 rather than enter an inferior endgame. He soon had to return the pawn and spoil his king's side pawn structure, but at the same time he managed to liquidate the pawns on the Queen's side. The game was drawn shortly afterwards. Queen's Indian defense Eco E15 1 D4 NF62 C4 E63 NF3 B64 G3 B flat 4 plus 5 BD2 B76 NC3 B flat 77 BG2 C68 E4 D59 EXD5 CXD510 Ni 5 0 0 1 1. 0 to 0 NC 6 12. CXD 5 NXE 5 13. D 6 NC 6 14. 
DXE7 QXE715 BG5H616 D5 Na517 BXF6 QXF618 DXE6 QXE619 RE1 QF620 ND5 BXD521 BXD5 Rad822 QF3 diagram QXB223 Rad1 QF624 QXF6 GXF625 Re 7 kg 726 RXA7 NC627 RB7 NB428 B flat 3 RXD1 plus 29 BXD1 NXA230 RXB6 NC331 BF3 F532 kg 2 road 833 RC6 Ni434 BXE4 FXE435 RC4 F536 G4 Road 237 GXF5 E338 RE4 RXF2 plus 39 Kilogram 3 RXF5 and a half to one half Topic Game 6 Carlson Anand 1 to 0 The sixth game was played on 15 November 2014. Carlsen adopted the space gaining Morozzi bind setup against the Can variation of the Sicilian defense, and accepted a set of isolated doubled pawns in return for active play. After an early queen exchange, he soon developed a commanding position and appeared to have excellent winning chances. At move 26, there was a double blunder. Carlsen's 26, KD2. Should have been answered with 26. NXE5. With a discovered attack on the G4 rook, 27, RXG8 NXC4 plus Zwischenzug, 28, KD3 NB2 plus 29, K2 RXG8, and Black will wind up with two extra pawns on E5 and C4 and excellent winning chances. However, Anand missed this and played 26. A4. Carlsen made no further mistakes and converted his advantage into a win. Sicilian defense, can variation Eco B41 1. E4 C5 2. Nf3 E6 3. D4 Cx D4 4. Nx D4 A6 5. C4 Nf6 6. Nc3 B flat 4 7. QD3 NC68 NXC6 DXC69 QXD8 plus KXD810 E5 ND711 BF4 BXC3 plus 12 BXC3 KC713 H4 B614 H5 H615 O O O B flat 716 Road 3 C517 RG3 RAG818 BD3 NF819 B3 G620 HXG6 NXG621 RH5 BC622 BC2 kilobits 723 RG4 A524 BD1 Road 825 BC2 RDG826 KD2 diagram A427 K2 A328 F3 road 829 K1 road 730 BC1 RA831 K2 bar 432 B4 plus BC633 BXG6 FXG634 RXG6 bar 435 RXE6 Road 136, BXA3 Ra 137, K3 BC 238, Re7 plus 1 to 0. Topic Game 7, Carlson Anand, one half to one half. 
The seventh game was played on 17 November 2014. The opening was the highly theoretical Berlin defense of the Rai Lopez. Carlsen retained a slight advantage, despite sacrificing a pawn. At move 31 Carlsen was poised to win back the e5 pawn, thereby establishing connected passed pawns, but Anand instead sacrificed his bishop for two pawns and cleared away all the pawns on the kingside. With an extra knight, Carlsen tried to win but he was unable to penetrate Anand's defenses. Eventually the players traded down into a rook and knight versus rook endgame that is a theoretical draw and Anand made no mistakes while defending it. Carlsen finally acquiesced to a rook exchange on move 121, drawing immediately. With this draw, Carlsen still led by one point. Rai Lopez, Berlin Defense E4 E5 2. NF3 NC6 3. B flat 5 NF6 4. 0 to 0 NX E4 5. D4 ND6 6, 6. BXC6 DXC6 6, 7. DX E5 NF5 8. QXD8 plus KXD8 9. H3 K810 NC3 H511 BF4 B712 Rad1 B613 Ng5 RH614 G3 BX G515 BX G5 RG616 H4 F617 EX F6 GX F618 BF4 NX H419 F3 Road 820. KF2 RXD 121. NXD1 NF522. RH1 BXA223. RXH5 B624. G4 ND625. RH7 NF726. NE3 KD827. NF5 C528. ING3 NE529. R H eight plus R G eight thirty B X E five F X E five thirty one R H five diagram B X G four thirty two F X G four R X G four thirty three R X E five B six thirty four Ne four R H four thirty five K two R H six thirty six B three K D seven thirty seven KD2 KC638 NC3 A639 RE4 RH2 plus 40 KC1 RH1 plus 41 KB2 RH642 ND1 RG643 NE3 RH644 RE7 RH245 RE6 plus KB746 KC3 RH447. KB2 RH248. ND5 Road 249. NF6 RF250. KC3 RF451. NE4 RH452. NF2 RH253. RF6 RH754. ND3 RH355. KD2 RH2 plus 56. RF2 RH457. C4 RH358. KC2 RH759. NB2 RH560. RE2 RG561. ND1 B562. NC3 C663. NE4 RH564. NF6 RG565. RE7 plus KB666. ND7 plus CA567. RE4 RG2 plus 68. KC1 RG1 plus 69. KD2 RG2 plus 70. K1 BXC471. RXC4 RG372. NXC5 kilobits 573. RC2A574. KF2RH375. RC1 kilobit 476. 
ND3 plus KXB378. Ra1 KC479. NF2 kilobits 580. RB1 plus KC481. Ni4 Ra382. ND2 plus KD583. RH1 A484. RH5 plus KD485. RH4 plus KC586. KD1 kilobit 587. KC2 RG388. Ni4 RG2 plus 89. KD3 A390. NC3 plus KB691. Ra4 A292. NX A2 RG3 plus 93. KC2 RG2 plus 94. KB3 RG3 plus 95. NC3 RH396. RB4 plus KC797. RG4 RH798. KC4 RF799. RG5 kilobits 6100. Na4 plus KC7101. KC5 KD7102. KB6 RF1103. NC5 plus K7104. KXC6 Road 1105. RG6 KF7106. RH6 RG1107. KD5 RG5 plus 108. KD4 RG6109. RH1 RG2110. Ni4 Ra 2111. RF1 plus K7112. NC3 RH2113. ND5 plus KD6114. RF6 plus KD7115. NF4 RH1116. RG6 Road 1 plus 117. ND3K 7118. Ra 6 KD 7119. K4 K 7120. RC6 KD 7121. RC1 RXC 1122. NXC 1 and a half to one half. This is the second longest game ever played in a World Chess Championship. The record is still held by the fifth game in the 1978 World Championships. Viktor Korchnoi and Anatoly Karpov played 124 moves before the game ended in a stalemate. <laughs> game 8, Anand Carlsen, one half to one half. The eighth game was played on 18 November 2014. The opening was a Queen's Gambit declined with 5, BF4 which had won for Anand in Game 3. Carlsen deviated from that game by playing 6 C5, an older line that was popular in the 1970s to 1990s but now less fashionable. During the game, Anand piled up a bishop and queen on the b1h7 diagonal against Carlsen's king, but Carlsen was able to initiate a series of exchanges and obtain an easily drawn endgame. Queen's gambit declined Eco d37, 1. d4 nf6 2. c4 e6 3. nf3 d5 4. nc3 b7 5. BF4 0 0 6. E3 C5 7. DXC5 BXC5 8. A3 NC6 9. QC2 Re8 10. BG5 B7 11. Road 1 QA5 12. BD3 H6 13. BH4 DXC4 14. BXC4 A6 15. 0 to 0 b5 16 bar 2 b flat 7 17 b 
B flat 1 rad 8 18 BXF6 BXF6 19 Ni 4 B7 20 NC5 diagram BXC5 21 QXC5 B4 22 RC1 BXA3 23 BXA3 QXC5 24 RXC5 Ni 7 25 RFC1 RC8 26 BD3 Red 8 27 RXC8 RXC8 28 RXC8 plus NXC8 29 ND2 NB6 30 NB3 ND731 Na 5 BC 832 KF1 KF833 K1 K734 KD2 KD635 KC3 Ni536 B2 KC537 F4 NC638 NXC6 KXC639 KD4 F640 E4 KD641 E5 plus one half to one half. Topic Game Nine Carlson Anand one half to one half. The ninth game was played on the twentieth of November, twenty fourteen. The opening was the Berlin defence of the Rai Lopez. The game was drawn due to threefold repetition on the twentieth move. This game included no original moves. The draw meant that Carlsen was closer to converting his one-point lead to a match win, though Anand seemed satisfied to draw early and focus on his two remaining games with the white pieces. Rai Lopez, Berlin Defense Eco C67-1, E4-E5-2. NF3 NC63. B-flat 5 NF64. 0 to 0 NX E4 5 D4 ND66 BXC6 DXC67 DXE5 NF58 QXD8 plus KXD89 H3 K810 NC3 H511 Ni2 B612 Road 1 bar 613 NF4 B flat 714 E6 BD615 EXF7 plus KXF716 Ing5 plus diagram KF617 Ni4 plus KF718 Ing5 plus KF619 Ni4 plus KF720 Ing5 plus one half to one half although a short draw at 20 moves this game is far from the shortest in match history a pair of 10 move draws sealed Petrosian's match victory over Botvinnik in 1963 topic <laughs> game 10 Anand Carlson one half to one half The tenth game was played on 21 November 2014. As in the first game, Carlsen played the Grunfeld defense but Anand met it with the Russian system instead of the exchange variation. Anand obtained a passed pawn on d5 that was isolated but well defended, and Carlsen was under pressure for much of the game. Anand's temporary bishop sacrifice 28, BXB7 allowed the d-pawn through to its queening square and so winning the piece back, but the resulting double rook endgame was equal and soon agreed drawn. Instead, 28, g3 was suggested as a way of keeping an advantage. Grunfeld defense, Russian system Eco D97 1. D4 NF6 2. C4 G6 3. NC3 D5 4. NF3 B G7 5. QB3 DXC4 6. QXC4 0 0 7. E4 Na 6 8. B2 C5 9. D5 E6 10. 0 to 0 EXD5 11. EXD5 Re8 12. BG5 H6 13. B3 BF5 14. Rad 1 Ni 4 15. 
NXE4 BXE4 16. QC1 QF6 17. BXH6 QXB2 18. QXB2 BXB2 19. ING5 BD4 20. NXE4 RXE4 21. BF3 RE7 22. D6 Road 7 23. BF4 NB4 24. Road 2 RE8 25. RC1 RE626. H4 B5 27. BXE5 RXE5 Diagram 28. BXB7 RXB7 29. D7 NC630. D8 equals Q plus NXD831. RXD8 plus kilogram 732. Road 2 and a half to one half. Topic Game Eleven Carlson Anand One to Zero. The eleventh game was played on the twenty third of November, twenty fourteen. As in the seventh and ninth games, the opening resulted in the well analyzed queenless middle game of the Berlin defense. In this game, Anand gained an initiative with the line opening pawn sacrifice twenty three b five. Carlsen declined the sacrifice, but Anand still had a somewhat easier position until he sacrificed an exchange by 27 RB4 in return for a protected passed pawn and free play for the bishops. Both players criticized this move afterwards, Anand describing it as, "...a bad gamble." Carlsen found a flaw in Black's plan and with 29, nh5, followed by 30, f4 he opened up lines for the white rooks to penetrate on the d-file. After the capture of the black pawn on f7, the white pawn on e5 became a dangerous passed pawn. White's king was in position to block the black pawns while the white pawns proved unstoppable. Anand resigned on move 45, thus conceding the match and Carlsen retained the title of world chess champion. Rai Lopez, Berlin Defense E4 E5 2. NF3 NC6 3. B flat 5 NF6 4. 0 to 0 NX E4 5. D4 ND6 6. BXC6 DXC6 7. DXE5 NF5 8. QXD8 plus KXD8 9. H3 BD7 10. NC3 H6 11. B3 KC8 12. B flat 2 C5 13. Rad 1 B6 14. RFE1 B6 15. ND5 G5 16. C4 KB7 17. KH2 A5 18. A4 Ni 7 19. G4 Ing 6 20. Kilogram 3 B7 21. ND2 R HD 8 22. Ni 4 BF 8 23. NEF 6 B5 24. BC3 BX A4 25. BX A4 KC6 26. KF3 RDB827 K4 diagram RB428 BXB4 CXB429 NH5 kilobits 730 F4 GXF431 NHXF4 NXF432 NXF4 BXC433 Road 7 RA634 ND5 RC635. RXF7 BC536. RXC7 plus RXC737. NXC7 KC638. NB5 BXB539. AXB5 plus KXB540. E6 B341. KD3 B742. H4 A443. G5 HX G544. HX G5 A345. KC3 1 0. Oh. 
Topic: Timeline of changes. There were several changes and controversies in the process of selecting the challenger and hosts for the championship. A timeline is given below. Topic: 2013. The 25th of August. Kanti Mansysk, Russia, announces its bid for the FIDE Candidates Tournament 2014. The 5th of October. FIDE deadline to bid for 2014 Candidates Tournament. Kozlodai, Bulgaria, requested an extension to the deadline until the 12th of October to provide a bank guarantee. The 7th of October. Kozlodai refused to bid for the 2014 Candidates Tournament. The 22nd of October. FIDE announces that the 2014 Candidates Tournament will take place from 12 to 30 March 2014 in Kanti Mansysk, Russia. The 22nd of November. Magnus Carlsen becomes World Chess Champion 2013 in Chennai, India and thus qualifies for the 2014 World Chess Championship match. Topic 2014. The 10th of January, FIDE announces procedure regulations for bidding to host the 2014 World Chess Championship match. The 21st of January, FIDE announces that all qualifiers for the Candidates Tournament 2014 in Kanti Mansysk have confirmed their participation and confirms the match schedule for the candidates' matches. The 10th of March, FIDE closing date for bid process to host the 2014 World Chess Championship match. The 11th of March, FIDE extended the bidding deadline to the 30th of April 2014, 1300 Greenwich Mean Time. The 29th of March, Anand wins the candidates tournament with one round to spare and thus qualifies to the 2014 World Chess Championship match. The 30th of April, new closing date for bid process to host the 2014 World Chess Championship match. Due to absence of bidders, FIDE announced to inform in due course. The 10th of May, originally expected date for signature of the final contract with the successful bidder for the 2014 World Chess Championship match. The 11th of June. Announcement of Sochi, Russia, being the venue for the 2014 World Chess Championship match. The 7th of November, the 2014 World Chess Championship match opening ceremony. Anand is allocated the white pieces for game one by a random draw. The 23rd of November, Carlson defends his World Championship title. Topic: Expectations, predictions, and match evaluation. Before the match began, many commentators believed that Carlson had very strong chances of winning. However, many assumed that Anand had learned from his mistakes in 2013 and would be a stronger opponent this time around. These commentators were vindicated. Carlson had to make a greater effort, winning the match with a ratio of wins to losses of 3 to 1 versus 3 to 0 in 2013. Commentators saw the match as more interesting precisely because Anand demonstrated himself as a much stronger player than he had done in 2013. Vladimir Kramnik predicted that Carlsen would win Game 11, whereas Sergei Karjakin expected the game to end in a draw. On the whole, few doubted that Carlsen would win the match. Sergei Karjakin noted that Anand was not in top form during the match. Anand himself admitted that his key sacrifice in the final game was an unjustified risk, and that Carlsen had played better throughout the match. <laughs> 